Hi everyone, it's Judy. Welcome back to Rose Lane. Today I have a mess. I have a mess. <laughs> Supposed to be cleaning and I'm not. Oh my goodness. Anyway, I'm sorry. I know that I should have put up videos a little earlier this week, but from Sunday afternoon through uh, yesterday afternoon, I would say, which was Tuesday, I really was not feeling well. I don't know if I had a stomach bug or what my problem was, but I really was not feeling well and just could not bring myself to to focus or stay down uh, here to do anything. So I missed a few days. I did got, get my videos up. So this one's going to be going up. Um, this is Wednesday night. So it'll be up at midnight tonight for tomorrow, which will be Thursday. So, um, but what I wanted to try to do was I started and I cut out um, card for these pockets, for these envelope pockets on the uh, B, Summer Bees journal thing. I don't know what that is. Little rough pieces. Um, so I'm not sure where it's coming from. See, I think it's something else. It's the picture under <laughs> Anyway, that's just me. Anyhow, I did cut them. Um, and let me show you how I measure um, when I cut, or when I try to cut for the pockets. So all I do is I take my ruler and I stick it out along the side and down to the pocket till it hits a little resistance. And then I decide how much above that I want it to go okay and then out here because I don't like really really snug um, tags or cards in the pockets where you have to really work them and then I just go from here so I usually go about a quarter inch in from either side and whatever that is um, so this would be for me probably like three and three quarters okay because I'd rather have a little room um, in the pocket so that you <clears throat> excuse me I don't have anything to drink down here either, but I do have my candy canes um, so that you don't have to fight it. So I did cut them. Um, there should be six of them here. And I started kind of doing some ideas of what I want to do. So here's two, here's four, five, six, okay? And I just wrote the sizes that I measured out measured them and wrote that on a pad over here okay and then when i cut them i wrote them in the corner so i couldn't mistake them for something else um i made myself some b labels um because i like you know some of them are cute where it says be happy like b-e-e -E happy and that's kind of cute but I, I really didn't want that right now for these so i made a sheet of my own I have them on some uh, honeycomb paper. I think I made some bigger somewhere. I don't know where they are. Um, they're around <laughs> someplace. I don't know, but they're around here somewhere. I just printed a whole bunch of stuff that I need to be fussy cutting. I've got all this stuff. I'm gonna be going away on vacation. I'm gonna hope that I can get some videos up. I'm looking for the larger ones. Um, this one was a misprint, but these were the larger. You can see they're bigger. Um, if I decided if I wanted something bigger, I could cut out some bigger ones, but you could see it misprinted, so it cut off the last one. But that's okay, because it was just four columns of the same thing, so it really didn't matter. So anyway, I am going to be going away uh, the 16th through the 21st. We'll be back late on the 21st. Um, and um, so... I'm hoping to get videos up for that week. If I don't, please forgive me, but I don't know. I can't seem to get ahead again. So keep trying, but it doesn't work. So this, and my nose is running. We're getting thunderstorms here right now. And I'm in the basement. And you generally can't hear it down here. At least not this side of the basement. On the side that has windows, you kind of can, maybe. Um, but I'm not on that side. I'm, a, I'm in the, truly in a dungeon down here. <laughs> um, so this is what I was going to do. I printed these papers, and they were from, and I don't know, I probably am not pronouncing it right, but very pair, very pair, or something, I don't know. It's V-E-R-I-E-P-E-A-R. It's all one word. Um, and she has like 
vintage papers that she, or uh, magazines or books or something like that, newspapers that she does, okay? I don't know if they're truly vintage or if she just kind of puts them together, you know, on her own from different bits and pieces. But um, this is the American Bee Journal from January 1st, 1903. Probably it is a legitimate, you know, copied papers. I don't know. But anyway, so I have, these are from the My Porch Prints. And like I said, these are my labels and I may do some bigger. Um, and then I had these and these were from, they were just a set of six, I think. One, two, three, four, five. I know it was not, oh, six. Um, these were from the Gypsy Journal Company, the Gypsy Journals Company on um, Etsy. It was just one page of these, these I think bumblebees or something it was called. I just like the colors. Um, I think they went pretty well with these, but they were a little bit different. Uh, so I don't know if I'll use these or not. Probably I'm looking at one over here I think I like. So this is my plan. This is what I was gonna do. I was going to cover these and I wanna make them tags. So I'm gonna cut the corners. Um, but I'm going to cover it with this, these sheets of paper from this bee journal. I'm going to try my best to get anything that mentions bees, even if it's just this, um, or honey, um, on the paper. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is go ahead here. And since this is honey and beeswax, and it's gonna come over here by books, I can use this part. It says bee over here, and probably I could use it on something else, I hope. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead, and I think what I'll do is do it on this side um, so that I can keep that uh, measurement until I cut the corners off so I know which pocket it's supposed to go in. Honestly, they shouldn't fit in any other pocket but the one they're meant to fit in. So, cause every size envelope there is different. So that is my thought. So I hope everybody is doing well. I am doing pretty well now that I'm over whatever that horribleness was for those few days. Um, I was going to bed early and I was sleeping a lot and, uh, yeah, so was not feeling well and at all digestively, intestinally and, uh, but I'm feeling better now. So I'm happy for that. The funny thing was, was I was hungry, which I thought was kind of odd. I'm just going to move these to the side so I don't play on them too much. Um, but yeah, I was hungry and I wanted to eat, which is really annoying because you want to eat, you're hungry. And yet when you do, it doesn't come out to be a happy thing. So yeah, I was not, <laughs> not doing well. So I'm glad it's behind me. So let's see, what do I have that I can Spread the glue with, I just dropped something else on the floor. That's okay. Let's spread the glue with this. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead, so I don't like to cut it right away when it's wet. Some people are really good at that. I'm not very coordinated with those things. So I'm gonna, actually, how much room do I have on this one? Uh, what do I think of this? Nope, too wide. Okay, let's do this one. That one is not too wide. And I should be able to get that B word, hopefully, on this one. So let's go ahead and we'll put this one down right next to it. I'll leave just a little bit of space just so that I can get the scissors in. So scissors are probably going to do with the scissors, honestly. Um, so anyway, so spring is springing. 
around here. It's getting warmer and the trees are budding and flowers are starting to bloom and it's getting to be very nice. So I'm happy about that. So that's that one. So anyway, just want to leave a little space. Come over here. Get that all right try to keep that from sliding too much all right let's get this one smoothed down so get that one going and I can see some glue oozing out here which is okay it's okay. All right. So that's good. Let me, I guess I'll put them this way. All right. Then we've got this one here. Um, 40 years among the bees. <laughs> Let's see. How about, um, I don't want to cut his head off, do I? Uh, I guess we can go here. No, 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 no. Let's see. Let's do you. I'm going to just do this one down this way, I think. Okay. This one says the American Bee Journal right here. This one is smaller. I don't know. I've got other ones over here though. I'll take a look at that. Let's see, we'll get these glued down first. Like so. So this bee journal is getting pretty close. I was hoping I would have it done before the end of the week, but those couple of days knocked me for a loop. And I mean, I even said to my husband, I think it was the night before last. I said, you know, I don't even want to go downstairs. I don't even want to go. I'm like, I just really don't feel good at all. So I was not happy about that. Needless to say, I'll try to get this so that it is even, if possible. That's pretty good. Okay, smooth that out there. I still don't know what's going to go on these, so. Um, all right, I'm going to leave this one over here. Let's see what else I have. I have one, two, three more to do. Okay, three, 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 three. Um, All right, we can, well, let's, what do I have here? That's kind of big. So I think some of these had, you know, honey and wax and stuff like that. But I think maybe able, oh, I have another one here. There's a lot about poultry on here. <laughs> um, I mean, it says stuff, but I think I can, I think I can get all, of these on here. Let's see. Will these go side by side? Possibly not. Let's see. Um, no. Okay, so I will have to use one of the other ones. I'm going to do this side and this side on here. Okay. So we'll go from the top on the one and the bottom on the other. I'm sorry, I keep forgetting to talk. <laughs> oh, so I've been kind of going a little nuts with some of these fussy cut things. I'm going to bring some of that with me 
when I visit my sister. And um, so I have stuff that I can do while I'm away. Is this the right side? Yes, that's the right side. Um, so I have to start thinking about, you know, it's not that long. We're Today is the, what, the 5th, I think, and we're leaving on like the 16th. So I don't have much time <laughs> to think about what I'm going to do. Now all I'm doing here is just trying to hold this down so that it doesn't move too much. And that is not what I'm looking for. This is what I'm looking for because I just got some glue on the back here. And while it's still wet, I'm going to get my glue eraser because it really does work. If you get it before it really dries, when you get like a smear and you and you wipe it, and, but they, you still have that shiny part, if you get it right away with this eraser, it comes off. It's really nice. Really nice. Okay. So then this one's going to go over here. We're going to do Sweet Clover on that. So we have part of, we have the e-journal. <laughs> okay, let's do some glue on this one. And then I just have one, two, three, I just have one more to do. And then we'll, I'm still not sure what I want to do. If I want to do tabs, if I want to do tabs with something else like lace underneath them, or if I want to do bits of lace, or do I want to do ribbon? on top of them. I'm not sure. I think I'll just have to do that a little bit after the fact, because putting these together tonight, I'm not even sure if I'll be able to get all of this in in the hour um, that I try to get done, at least in an hour, preferably under if I can, but I'm not generally successful in doing that. So, um, down there. All right. Let's get that like so. This, I'm not sure. There's a lot. It's the bee journal. I don't know what chickens have to do with bees, but there's a lot of chicken stuff in this journal. I don't know what that is. So, okay. We have that one or those two. Now, let's see. What did I figure? We have honey jars down here. Maybe we can do that. Still got that chicken stuff going on. Or do I want to go over here? Maybe I want to go over here. I think maybe I want to go over here. So what I'm going to do, this is a pen. I don't really want a pen. I want to go from here. Okay. That's where I want the top of it to go. Okay. Okay. And then I'm just going to go back. What's my time so far? Oh, that's not too, too bad. Okay. All right. So I'm hoping I have, I have other stuff from the kit, um, from the summer bees kit that I've already put, you know, I've already put the card backing on them. I put them on the the cardstock already and they're cut and ready to go and they'll go in those um i'll think of it those accordion pockets um some of that will go in there there's so much in this kit honestly that i have plenty to do like another journal without probably having to print anything else so um so that's a that's a good thing, I think. Just got to leave this sit for a second because it's it's gloppy glue and it's very wet when you first put it down. And um, wants to slide. But I'll tell you, once it's down, it's good. And like I said, this is the only glue that I had found that, um, I'm just trying to get it off this mat that when I, you know, do this, and I see, I laid it in there. Okay. 
uh, when I, you know, s push it down like this and, and try to get, you know, kind of spread it out for better coverage, once it's dry, you can't feel it. You don't know that, that it was glued down. It's really, I love the glue. <laughs> Thankfully for me, the smell really doesn't bother me. So a lot of people, it bothers them, but oddly enough, it doesn't bother me. Okay, so I'm just going to take this one and put it to the side. Well, actually, I'm going to put it to the side. I'm going to go back to the first ones. Find my little scissors, if it's possible, because I do better with the small ones. And we're going to go ahead and try to cut these out. Now, if they are a little loose and I need to glue the corners, I'll do that later. I'm not going to worry about it for right now, but I'll get it. I'll get it done right. But for right now, I want to get them decorated and show you what they're looking like. See how quickly I can do these tags. Don't know. My husband's phone is ringing. Hear that. So, I'm cutting this wrong. <laughs> Yeah, I caught the edge of it. The cover, or the color of the cardstock and the white, um, so I'll trim this back down later. Um, I'll have to trim that off. I did that already uh, with the cutter, but I really have to wait until that dries. Um, it's a very similar shade for me, this off-white creamy color and the white paper. Sometimes it's hard for me to distinguish where one begins and the other one ends. So I'm trying to press my scissors up against the edge and not go over the edge of the cardstock, but use it instead as a guide for where to cut, which is of course what you do, but my judgment is not always that great. <laughs> so, okay, that's two. All right, I'm just gonna snip this. I'm going to put that to the side. So let's go to this one. I said I may not get all six of these done in the hour, but we'll give it a shot. We'll see what we can do. Okay. So I'm really liking how that honeycomb stuff that I did for the cover, I love how that came out. Um, really pretty, I thought. And I thought of it later, and I haven't done it yet, but I have beeswax, and I'm not going to melt it or anything. Um, I just want to maybe rub it over it some, you know, over the... Um, what looks like the honeycomb, that fabric mesh stuff, and maybe give it a little bit more of a waxy feel so it feels a little more um, authentic. This looks like it's hanging over the waist bit. Just a wee bit. Here we go, I think that's okay. It's funny how some things I can see and some things I can't. And I'm actually going to be seeing my eye doctor next week. And um, I started writing a whole list of things because even though I'm heading for a year since all of this, uh, two years, I'm sorry, since all of this started with my eye, um, I still have so many questions. And um, I always forget, you know, when you get there, you think of all these things. And when I get there, I forget to ask them all these other questions. So this time I decided I am going to write the questions down and give myself a list and see if I can get some answers because, um, okay, this is the last one because I know, you know, I'm, I, I still have issues with it. I mean, obviously the site's not going to come back, but um, we know that the eye is shrinking. And so there's a lot of, you know, different things to consider about maybe replacing the eye at some point. Um, 
but I want to know what all that actually entails and you know just there's a lot of things a lot of questions so I'm trying to be a little bit more thorough uh, in my thoughts because you know when it first happens it kind of <laughs> literally catches you off guard and I've been spending you know I spent a lot of time trying to heal and trying to accept it and get used to it and I tell my husband still now I said you know I still can't believe it I just it really I still can't believe that it actually happened and uh, I mean I know it <laughs> I live with it every day but it's just, I, I still can't get past that, you know. I just can't get past it. Ooh, oh no, I didn't, okay, good. All right, so I think this one is for the back. I don't really, it doesn't really matter to me uh, what goes where, except I thought for the small one, I wanted to do like this on here. And you can still, and you can see this clover, but you can see the word bees down here. I'll probably round the corners. Um, I'm going to need this. I'm not going to bother covering it exactly. So this one says golden summer, which I liked because of the yellow flowers. I'm going to go ahead and just glue these down. Um... I'm thinking, I don't usually like to put stuff too bulky on the um, tags because I think it makes it harder to get them in and out of the pockets. So <clears throat> I want to try to consider what I want to do here. Um... I don't know. I'm going to cut some of these bigger quickly if I can. Or at least some of them anyway. Um, go up the side here. Get rid of this piece, but I will use it at a later date. As a matter of fact, if I can get a piece done for Saturday, I'm going to be using all these cutoffs. Um, I'm cutting these by hand. The other ones I cut on my cutter to try to be more uniform, but this one I'm going to just try to cut some of these out by hand. Okay, just get that little corner deep. Okay, cut that side down. All right, let's see what I think if I want the bigger one on this one. I need it centered. Well, I don't need it centered. I was thinking about doing it sideways, but it's really not working for me, you know? I do like the larger label. So, I think I'm just going to go ahead and do that. All right, let's put this down. Put this one on. I wouldn't exactly call this collaging, but, um, you know, just, I don't know, just decorating the tags a little bit. Okay, so let's go ahead. This is going to be off-center just the slightest bit to give me room for that tag. I mean, that label. Try to make sure it's straightish. Okay. And then we'll put this one on. And I may go back and add like another flower over it or something like that. Now I don't really have anything cut out right now. So I may do that or add another bee or something like that. I want to move it in a little bit because I do want to round those corners. Okay. So... Straighten that out some. I'm just going to go ahead and cut one here. And hey! <laughs> I 
All right, now I gotta figure out which way it went. It went like that, okay. I'm not usually real good at this. I watch other people do this and they do it so well and then I screw it up all the time. So usually what I'll end up doing is trying to use a pencil with it. Yeah, so I may go back and put like a little, another little flower here and a bee or a flower out here and a bee there or something, but I don't have that cut out right now. So, but you'll see it in the, oh, I want it around the corners. Only if I can find my corner rounder. <laughs> here it is. Okay, we'll do it on seven. Okay. Very good, very good. Around the corners. It get, makes them easier, I think, to get them in and out of the pockets, especially if the pockets tend to be kind of tight. Okay, so this one, if I got this right, if I got this right, this one goes in this pocket right here. So let's open that up, and that's going to go right in there. Okay, so that's the first one. Okay, let's see what this one is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and round the corners on this one. We're using the sevens. Okay. Alrighty, what do we want to do on this one? <laughs> um, we have that. I don't know if I want to do more than one. Um, I'm not sure what I want to do here. Got a lot of space. A lot of space. Because that's a tall tag. Okay, I think it goes like this. Like that. And let's see. What would we say? I'm going to use a big one on here, too. So, let me cut this one out. Not too well. All right, let's even this puppy out. Because it did not do a good job on that one. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought, actually. All right, let's get this one down a little slimmer on that side and we'll bring this one this way Got a little hump there okay all right let's go ahead and try to do a little inking on this and I'm not worried if I don't get every spot it's just for little accentuating it and setting it apart. I'm waiting for my husband to come down and say, I thought you were going to come up and eat that spaghetti. <laughs> okay. This was just a little piece that was in the kit. Wasn't really sure what I would use it for. So it looks like I'm going to use it to fill in the gap on this, this card a little bit. Okay. All right, so... I'm going to put that one down first. I'm covering all the honey and all, all of those words. Probably wouldn't have mattered. So, okay. I'm trying to do this all as quickly as I can so that um, you might hear my husband talking in the background. Up there, I'm not sure who he's talking to, but he is on his phone, so he may not realize I have a little paper sign that I hand wrote filming on. And he came down one day and he said, "Your sign says you're Fleming," and I'm like, "Are you kidding me?" I said, "Did I spell it wrong?" He's like, "No, I just thought I'd just say that." I was like, "Oh, thanks." So now he'll say, oh, are you going to go Fleming? 
that I was like, yes, I'm going to go Fleming. But I didn't tell him. I didn't tell him this time. I wasn't going to. I was just going to take my fussy cutting upstairs and have a little bit of a late dinner. Not too much. Some leftover uh, pasta from the other day. I'm not overly, overly hungry. So earlier I thought I'd just have some yogurt, but they made the pasta and they left some out for me. So, okay. Blossoms and blooms. I thought that was nice because of all these flowers. So I tried to do some things that said summer stuff on them. I have, and bee related things. So it's beeswax, honeycomb, summer bees, which is the name of the kit. Um, golden summer, a honeybee, bumblebee, summer sweet, and blossoms and blooms is what I put on them. So, and I'll probably, again, add some flowers down and around here to fill that in. The moment, I'm going to leave it. Like I said, I just wanted to get the basics done on here because I didn't exactly know what I would need. So, I don't know if I will get that... Um, that was a little crooked, that one. Now I'm going to have to put something on it. Um, I don't know if I'll get that in a, in a video beforehand or if you'll just see it, uh, when I do the flip through. Um, so we'll see about that. Let me go ahead and, uh, cut this way. It took off part of the bee again. <laughs> this one is kind of... Kind of tight for me with my fingers. I got chubby fingers and I get in my way, you know. Okay, there we go. Hopefully that wasn't too bad. All right, let's get some ink on. You know what? I don't think I inked the back of that one. Let's go back and do the backs. Okay. Let's see. So, I think I want to get the one, because I thought this one with um, Summer Sweet on it, and I'm finding I may want to do the bigger labels. They kind of fill in the tags pretty well. All right, so that's that one. Let me see which one. I lost them. Oh, here they are. Okay, so was it going to be this one? No, that one was too small. It's either this one, probably this one. Yeah, I think we'll do it here. And let's find Summer Sweet, which we have one right here. We'll cut up this way was a little high for the bumblebee one. All right, let's see. Let's even this out some. By the time I cut all of these things off, I think I'm going to go back and, and realign them because when I cut in between them, you can't even tell that I've got a honeycomb background on these things. <laughs> can't even tell. So, all right, let's get this one on here. All right, so, oh, golly, all right, so that's that one, I don't know, I may wait, you've got a basic idea of what I'm doing here. So maybe we'll just try to do three and finish them. What's my time? Mm, okay, I might be able to do that. Instead of trying to do all six on camera, part way, I'll try to do three completely. So let's see what happens. You're gonna have to watch me fussy cut though, because I was not prepared. I was not prepared with fussy cutting. I have fallen behind. Do have butterflies, but I wasn't going to put any butterflies in this in this one. 
because I wanted to focus on the bees. The bees, the bees. All right, so we're going to put that there. Up, 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 up. I think I'm going to go up a little higher. I know I'm leaving a lot of um, glue behind, but I can get that off. Okay. We'll know that that's stuck down good and tight <laughs> down there because <laughs> I smeared the glue all the way up. All right. And then we'll put Summer Sweet right here. I think that's fine. Yep, we'll put Summer Sweet right over here. And then we've got Honey Jar right above it. How perfect was that? Okay. All right, and then we'll round the corners and that's kind of cute because it kind of outlines the label a little bit, which is kind of nice. That looks good. All right, let's go ahead and cut this one and try to line that up on that side. See if I can cut it without cutting my fingers. If I cut my fingers, it'll be a very short video, guys. <laughs> Forgot seven. Okay, round our corners a little bit. All right, let's get rid of you. Hmm, got speckles on the back. That's from working it's all those little things. But you know what? They actually kind of look neat. When you have one or two, it doesn't look so great, but when it's speckled like that, it really looks kind of nice. I'm gonna see if I wanna go back and speckle anything more. Speckle you. Speckles. <laughs> speckle these things. That looks kind of pretty. That's nice. That was another little happy accident. Okay, let me take these three and I'm just gonna move them to the side. Okay, let me take this one back out. So we have two with the um, My Porch Prince and then one with this one on it. So let's see. I have these. I have some large bees. Okay. These are a little bit easier for me to cut. So I have that one. Uh, then let's go to this one okay um probably down on here because that's a big card and then let's do one from the side a little smaller Ooh, i just cut his antenna off that's okay i probably wouldn't keep it anyway sometimes they're just too small um don't like that one. I cut them up too much. A little bee there. Okay. All right. When I do something this small, this is just regular copy paper because they're too, too small to, um, to, to cut out of anything heavy for me anyway. So that, that's just for me. So I'm going to take one of these guys, just cut out these three bees and see how quickly I can put this together. All righty. These are really pretty bees. I'm not sure. I think these were hers. I think these were out of her kit and I just took them and made some of them, made them smaller on some and larger on the others. They were pretty big and I didn't need them all so big. So just made them a little smaller. All right. Trying to bring this back around. I usually cut this part out first. I 
didn't do that this time. I usually will go start with the legs and the antenna. What I'm going to do here is just go along the bottom of the legs. And then I'll come in and cut them each on their own. At least I will try. The reason why I usually will do that, and I'll try to do them on the other ones, is because it gives me, before I cut out the rest of it, it gives me that chunk of paper to hold on to. When I cut the paper away, around the bee or whatever, the flower or whatever it is I'm doing, then I have nothing to hold on to, or not enough to hold on to, and uh, it makes it harder, harder for me to cut it out. So, like right now, this is gonna be a problem. I'm gonna try to cut it. Okay. And let's get from this side now. Let's see if I can cut that one. How close am I here? I don't wanna cut his leg. Ah, I did. All right, well, you'll see me, you'll see how I glue on legs now. It's just that one little piece of paper that wouldn't cut. All right, so there's his leg. Let me turn it over so I know. It won't turn over. All right, let's go ahead. I'll ink him a little bit, especially on the legs and the antenna. And we'll go up here. All right. I'm going to put him here, I think, on this side. Okay. I'll do that with my art glitter glue. If it if it's coming out, it's not. Okay. Let's get a pen. Clean it out. It's funny, it really didn't feel very plugged up, but apparently it was. Okay. So, go ahead and put him down. They're on his legs. Okay, I'm gonna flip him to where I want him, which is going this way. And now all I'm gonna do is where that leg goes, I'm gonna put just a little smear. I'm gonna grab my very tiny, if I can find them, I really have to clean, guys. I keep saying that. Can't find the tweezers. <laughs> okay, well, let's see what we can do. What I will do is I'm gonna get a pin. I just licked it a little bit and put that right down there. Press it in. No one's the wiser except whoever just watched this video. Guess you're wiser. Okay, can't pick these things up, good grading. All right, so that's that one. Um, I think I wanna do this B. Hmm. And this one, only because I've already got one doing that. I don't want two on there, so I'm gonna, I'll use this B on here. I got glue hanging off my fingers. And let's go ahead and do the antenna and the feet or legs first while I have myself some paper to hold on to. It is so much easier. Okay. All right, put that up there for now. And then let's go back down this side. This is the same B that I just cut out on the other one. Okay. Go around that way. All right, let's go ahead in here little bit more paper that I can hold on to here. Okay, that 
that's one. I'm gonna go from this end first. Okay. All right. Wish I had those tweezers. Be a lot easier to get my tweezers in here than my little chubby fingers. Oops, a little close on that one. Okay, and then I'm just gonna have to dig out some flowers um, that I can try to fussy cut out and add to the tags. Let's see, I know I'm pretty much out of them see if I can find the tub that I had them in. I'm sure it's gotten buried. <laughs> so, but I don't think I have too many left from when I when I was finished with one of the last journals. I have it here somewhere. Okay. There we go, and on his wings, just a little bit. And that one was going here, right? And I'm thinking up this way, maybe? Or maybe here? Could do it here and put some flowers there. Okay, let's try that, okay? Okay, we can do that. Plug myself up again because I didn't cover it. All right, very good, very good. Let's take him and put him here like that. All right, so that's that one. I'm just shoving this stuff up this way, guys, to kind of get it out of the way. All right, let's go ahead and do this little fella now. Okay. swing. Sometimes it's so hard to see when they're they're fuzzy, you know, like misty edges on things and stuff. It's hard to make out. I think even if I had both my eyes, it would be hard to make out where they start and stop, you know. Okay. Sorry, I'm not talking too, too much. Or maybe you're happy I'm not talking too, too much while I'm trying to cut these things out. And I just am trying to do them as quickly as I can. Try to clean that out a little bit. Get you a little more curved. Okay. All right, so I'm really excited about this trip. Um... I haven't seen my family in, uh, well, my sister and brother-in-law, and they were up last July. So it's been less than a year, which is nice, and that's happening because she lives so much closer to me now um, than she did before, because she was out west before, and now she's just down south. So, and I seem to keep getting closer and closer, so, which is all right. Um, so anyway, uh, but my niece, I haven't seen my niece probably three years. I'm trying to think, because three years ago was COVID. It's probably longer than that since I've seen my niece because... Um, my sister and brother-in-law and my brother and sister-in-law, when I had the first surgery done on my eyes, they had come um, and stayed with me and visited. Um, but my niece did not come up at that time. I think I'm gonna smooth you out a little bit. Um, 
Where, there it is. I can never find stuff that I'm looking for. Because <laughs> I have a mess. Um, and she didn't come last year. And uh, I think I want to go this way with this one. Because... Just because, because that one's going that way, I think. I think, I think, I think that's what I want to do. Um, and so she didn't come last year. And she didn't come up the other summer, the year before, 2021. And in 2020, nobody went anywhere. We had plans. But, you know, nobody went anywhere because of COVID, 2019, that had to be the last time I saw my niece. So let me, give me one second. I'm gonna see if I can find my little tubs. That thing's buried again. But I've got some stuff in here. Um, Mostly they're butterflies. I just keep saying, oh, I'll drop them in here. I'll drop them in here. I don't know if they'll work. It's not quite what I'm looking for. Um, this, I think, is all labely taggy things. Okay, let me close that one up. Just trying to see if I can find a few spares. Just a few spares. Um of something that I have cut out. Some of them can be smaller. That one. Um, don't want those. I'm trying to see what else I have cut. I'm not sure what will work best. That's a nice big one. All right, let's see what else. They're all flipped the wrong way. <laughs> that one, but I don't think that's going to be what I want either. All right, what's this one? Oh, that could be something. All right, let's go. Oh, that's something. Let's see what else I have. If I have anything in this one. Oh, my, 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 my. I have birds. Bingo cards, I have this, I have this. I'm trying to find things a little pinker, a little bigger. Nope, oh, birds, okay. Let's see what I can do with what I have here. These were butterflies. This was a little cluster I did with my, my little rosebud buttons and I'll put it in something someday. Let me just put that over there. Something's probably going to come crashing down. Let's see what I have here. All righty. Um, it's too big. That's a possibility. Um, ooh. Which way? This way? Maybe. That looks good here. Down here. Like this? No. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. This one. Hmm. That's kind of neat because it goes right in between the letters. I like that. I like that. Uh, and I think I like that. But if I do that, should I not do something else over here? Give it a little more balance to where where here yeah okay all right i think we like that so let's go ahead i don't need too much of this 
I'll stand up and check my time. Oh my gosh, I'm just at an hour. But I'm going to just finish these up, guys. Fortunately, I didn't have to cut anything. I just had to search a little bit. <laughs> All right, so I like that one here. Okay, he's coming off. And this one over here. Yeah, so it'll be nice to see my niece. This is, my son is coming out the day before we leave and he will um, take the train to come to us and uh, come on now. And um, then we will drive down together and then we'll come back here and he'll take the train back home. But my son and my niece, my niece was adopted when she was not quite two, about 19 months. And ever since they met each other as toddlers, literally as toddlers, she was like two and he was like, you know, three and a half. Um, what did I say this way? Um, ever since they uh, were, you know, toddlers and they met, they have just loved each other. And they're like best friends, best pals. And she is the one who is pregnant. And um, so we'll be seeing her a few months before her little girl is born. Um, but at least we'll get to see her. And because uh, it's been a few years now since we've seen her. It's been far too long. So, I'll be happy to uh, to be able to see her again. It's been, a, been too long. All right, I don't know what I'm going to do with the tops. I may just do um, some simple tabs, which I can do here. Let's see, could you have seen me trying to do six of these? <laughs> yeah, that's not happening. I think we'll just do some simple tabs like so nice okay we'll do that and actually I don't want to use that because I like having the ability to move if necessary like Lou was plugged up because I didn't cover it all right so we'll put this one on And then we'll go ahead, try to clean my glue out a little bit, and glue this down. Okay. I squish that to the side. No squishing. All right, so that's that one. So I just made some of these tabs when I do some of these cutaways and I have a strip or two left. Um, that's what I've been doing is trying to cut either uh, little circles that will um, work for uh, policy envelope closures um, or something else if I decide to do some sort of um, I will ink the backs of these later. If I decide to do some sort of a charm or, you know, something like that, um, they work on those. Or if I have a big enough space, I'll cut these tabs out. Okay, that's two. And one more. So that should work. Okay, we'll flip this one over. I really like the way that looks. I think, well, maybe not always, but I think if I'm gonna be doing this with card like this, I may just go ahead and leave 
the little speckles and kind of work them around the backs of the tags. If you get one or two spots, I, you know, I really don't like it, but if you get tiny little speckles all over, it looks kind of neat. And I'm liking that. Waste not, want not, right? <laughs> okay. So that is it. Let's clear these things out. Move this back. And these are the three tags that we did for the envelope flaps on the back. So that's it for tonight, guys. Um, hopefully this wasn't too, too long. And that's it. So I will probably, hopefully, see you on Saturday. But in the meantime, be blessed, be happy, and take care, be safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.